Hello, everyone. It is that time of year uh, getting into Schoology and setting up your new courses. If you ran out of time at the end of the previous school year to grab your folders and units from past courses to add to your resources, I wanted to show you how you can access all of your past archived courses. So we're here in Schoology and we're going to click on Courses and then go over to My Courses. That's going to act, open up your current or active courses. We want to click on Archived. And from here, you will see all of your courses from previous school years. So you can see here uh, the marking period and school year, those courses were active. And you can go down and find the course that you are interested in bringing material over from. Uh, so for example, if I want to go into um, my asynchronous workshop from last year, I can click on this section and come over here and you'll see that this is ended. This is an archived course. So I can't really manipulate things in here, but I can copy things from in here. So maybe this is a unit folder that I want to bring over into an active course for this year. I can click on the drop down menu and do either copy to courses or save to resources. And we do always recommend that you save your unit folders, lesson folders, resources, anything that you want to use again in another school year, save to your resources. Um, but we don't want to do a double process right now. We just want to get this copy to courses. When you click on copy to courses, it's going to give you the option of bringing this to any current active course. Uh, so I'm going to throw this into my sandbox because I don't actually need it anywhere. Um, but when you select the course, and you can select multiple courses, but I only want this in one place. Um, and then I can decide, do I want this to be on the main menu? So the main materials page, I say none, so no folder. Or if I already have some folders set up, I can throw it into a folder. I'm going to leave it none and hit copy folder. When I get over to my sandbox course now, I would see that folder listed and there it is. So lesson one, the gaming trifecta from my games course is now in my sandbox course. Um, so super easy to do. Again, we go to courses, my courses over there on the right, archived courses, and then you should see a list of any archived course that you taught last year or in previous years. So I can go back to my last active school year in the classroom, the 2021 school year, and I can go into my archived courses and grab folders from those courses and add them to a current active course. So say I was going back into the classroom and I hadn't saved these things to my resources. Everything is still there and I can bring those um, folders and items into a current active course. As easy as that. If you need any help, please don't hesitate to reach out to me, Kathy Schock, or Darren Keel as the instructional technology coaches for the middle and high schools. Good luck.